there is actually a special kind of playlist that maintains itself. So you don't need to look after that playlist and tracks are automatically added to that. For example, tracks within a certain BPM range or tracks of a certain genre in a certain BPM range, for example. That is called an intelligent playlist or sometimes also called smart playlist. To create a smart playlist, right click on playlists again and then click on create new intelligent playlist. This will open a dialog because it is automatically contained so I can give it a name but I also need to specify the specific conditions that the tracks in this playlist must meet. For example, I want to create a playlist uh, from 125 BPM to 130 BPM. In the first box over here, I can select which label I want to select and that can be a couple of different things, album, album artist, artist, BPM, color, comments, composer, etc, etc, etc. In this case, I'm going to choose BPM. I can say a BPM needs to be exactly, for example, 128 BPM, I can do that, but I can also say the BPM must be above a certain BPM or a BPM is in the range of a certain BPM. Let's choose is in the range. And now I enter 125 because I want to add tracks that are at least 125 BPM and two, I say 130 because tracks with 130 BPM must be also in there. I can add extra criteria to that by clicking on the plus over here because I can say it must be from a certain genre. And I say, okay, that must be equal to, and now I need to make a selection and I click on the arrows over here and it must be, for example, Electra House. And then I click, okay. Now you see on the left side, it created a playlist that says 125 to 130 BPM. And you can distinguish an intelligent playlist from a normal playlist by looking at the cog icon over here. If I want to change these conditions, I can right click again and from the contextual menu, I say, edit the intelligent playlist. And now I get the same dialog as before. And for example, I want to remove the genre. And I click OK. And you see it automatically updates all the tracks in this playlist. When I would import a new track into Recordbox and it falls within this BPM range, it is automatically added to this playlist. More Recordbox tutorials you can find in this playlist over here. And don't forget to subscribe to my free DJ Tips emails. The link is in the description and I'll throw in a free ebook to start off your DJ career.